This is the Persian song which Baba had composed in Dehradun when we were with him in the garden. Gune garam walekin khush nasiba Gune garam walekin khush nasiba Khuda vanda gariba Bas gariba Khuda vanda gariba Bas gariba Gune garam walekin khush nasiba Gune garam walekin khush nasiba with Baba it was all the simple meals, dal and rice, and vegetable and chapati at night. And nobody could get sick. We were all very strong, healthy. We travelled all day, we sometimes didn't eat all day. We start get up at midnight, start two o'clock on the road, because it was so hot, dusty, and and it would get hot in the summer, you know. There were no highways, roads were still dusty roads and uh, Baba wanted to avoid everybody getting sunstroke or anything. Rahambar haliyin miskin gadakun Rahambar haliyin miskin gadakun Ke darish ke to man yak taasira Ke darish ke to man yak taasira So from which started two o'clock in the morning <laughs> and Baba uh, said we'll, we would have these rest houses the British had, you know that they were still, the British were still here then. So these dark bungalows they are known as, so Baba would get them reserved. We stopped the, at the dark bungalows, there were no dark bungalows. This was also a dark bungalow, you know. The, before Baba got this property, mm -hmm. this was a dark bungalow. Like uh, the, when the British were here, they would, the engineers would come and stop for the night. Mm -hmm. And yeah, this was built when Baba got the property. But before that, there was only this little two rooms bus. And I remember as a child, we used to come here for picnics when I was very young. So I'm surprised to see that Papa got his back again. So, so we would stop at dark bungalows, take our lunch, get down, and start again further. Sometimes Papa would say, are you all hungry? We said no, Baba. We, we 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 knew Baba didn't like the place. He didn't want to stop there. So he would say, "Can we go a little further? I this place is not good." He says, yes, Baba. Whatever you say. Sometimes from two in the morning, we just go on and on and on till we would reach at six in the evening. Mm. And Baba would say, "Are you all hungry?" We said no, Baba. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I would get up in the early morning when Baba said we have to start at 2. That means I must prepare for the meals also, you know. We had to prepare our own meals and carry it on the bus. Because we stopped the bus, Baba said quickly eat, we spread under the trees, bring whatever we cooked. So I had cooked mung dal, which is very easy, quickly done in the early morning. A nice big pot like that. We were 30 people on the bus. And we carried it on my lap. Hot, put some thin blankets and things, and put that thing, covered it up. But from 2 o'clock in the morning till 6 in the evening, the heat, shaking and rattling in that bus, mm -hmm. that ba Baba said, I quickly served the food. I opened the dal, and the dal was, I opened the dal, I never seen dal like that. I said, my God, it was happy. It was coming up in bubbles. <laughs> and was going, oh, I'm just in I smelled it. It didn't smell good. So I went to Baba's Baba. I 
took the babusa to Baba and said, Baba, this dal doesn't look too good. What can I do, Baba? I have to cook something else. Baba said, what's wrong? So Baba, the dancing dal, Baba said, it's popping up and now. So Baba said, it's bad. Hot and sour doesn't look nice. Throw it away. So I had to catch the bubble and go in the fields out where we were staying. Empty the dal. I said, Have you got milk? We quickly make tea for all. Go to empty the flask. We took a big flask, you know, milk on the bus. So as soon as we get down, we make our own tea. And uh, we bought the milk. Big chunks of cheese came out. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so so Baba, the milk has gone bad. What can we do now? Baba said, throw it out. Black tea. I said, okay. So we prepared black, mild tea for everybody. The mother said, what do we have? So Baba, dry bread and some cheese tins we had. Elizabeth would buy some craft cheese, you know. So we cut that out in slices. Baba broke all the bread. We had bread and cheese for tea, and that was our supper. Mm -hmm. So, then we had one year's fasting for one year, means only one meal a day. And we had to have tea in the morning, one meal in the afternoon, one meal at four o'clock, and finished. You know. So on while we were travelling, we were on the fast also. And uh, but we did only what Papa did, asked us to do. He said, You will not you must not fast, meditate or keep silence on your own unless I tell you. So we never do it. Except we observe. Baba's 10th of July, which is very important for 24 hours. So, so one day somebody came here to see new Baba Lord. And I said, Hello, Jay Baba. Good dog. He said, What's wrong? Are you all right? <laughs> he says, I'm keeping silence. So, why? I want to keep silence. Papa tell you to keep silence or something? I keep silence. Not necessary. Why do you want to keep silence? Because Baba kept silence. Baba says, don't do what I do. Do what I ask you to do. That is important. Don't do it to please yourself. Keep your keeping silence is not going to do anything to you. Baba's silence, Baba's one day of silence, he works for the whole world. That's different. If we keep silence all our lives, nothing's going to happen. So Baba would say, don't try to do what I do. Many people also want to Baba. Then Baba gives some of us silence for one year. Four or five people were given silence for one year. We were given silence for one month. After one year was over, Baba asked, You can speak now. Take my name and open. Break your silence. They wanted to continue more. We all said, No, Baba, please. Baba, we got crazy. We got the reading signs <laughs> all day long. It was mad, you know. It was very difficult because um, we understood Baba. Baba spoke to us, we understood. But they were doing their own alphabet, so it was very difficult to read. It was mad for one year, living with them and going here, this, 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 all the time. We get crazy. So we protested. <laughs> we said, Baba, no, enough Baba, they had. We had enough of it, Baba. We said, thank you, Baba. If you ask them to do it for one year, it's enough. <laughs> so Baba said, no, no, you know. I said, one year, it's over. Twins, I had my work, and I asked you to do it. 
गुनेगारम व लेकिन खुश नसीबम गुनेगारम व लेकिन खुश नसीबम खुदावंदा गरीबम बस गरीबम खुदावंदा गरीबम बस गरीबम गुनेगारम व लेकिन खुश नसीबम रहम पर हाल इन में स्किन गदा कुन रहम पर हाल इन में स्किन गदा कुन के दरिश के तो मन यक तासीरम के दरिश के तो मन यक तासीरम गुनेगारम वलेकिन खुश नसीबा